have the pleasure to be here because I'm collaborating in a big project on anesthesia mortality together with Professor Nacho Redondo from this university, then Professor Miguel Gonzalo Marcila from University of Edinburgh, and Professor Polly Taylor from the UK and Mark Johnson from the UK that initiated the same project CPEF-1 in 1995. To date, we are together with the collaborators that I named initially, and we have started a new phase of this CPEF inquiries into equine fatalities here in Valencia. So far, we have collected uh, more than 18,000 cases from all over the world, uh, 20 countries, uh, four continents, countries like Australia, United States, Argentina, of course, Spain, Switzerland, Belgium. And a very important aspect as well is that we are doing this with new technologies that allow us to do that in a short period of time of six months. We have presented the first uh, results and they are now published with 8,000 uh, anesthetics in which we can see uh, new trends and new techniques uh, that happened in the last uh, 20 years. Also promising results seeing potentially reduction in, in anesthesia, uh, in, in mortality. Right? The main support uh, of the Cardenal Herrera University to this project uh, is to develop a, a tool for collecting data uh, wherever the cases are uh, done. People from different countries working in Argentina, Brazil or the United States can send uh, their cases using their mobile phones or laptops with different operative systems. And we get this information in a database and uh, we can analyze this information in a real time using techniques uh, of big data and machine learning. So it's just, just a pleasure uh, to be here in Valencia and in FEO and, and be part of this very important study, multi-center, you know, worldwide uh, study about mortality uh, in horses.